Hey, Pastor Randy here today. I've got a treat for you lined up. Welcome to Christian Answers to Facebook Meetings. Uh, you know there's a lot of people out there on, the face, on Facebook and all social media just uh, wanting to demean Christians. And um, I want to talk about one of those uh, in particular, something that just happened to me recently. And uh, I want to remind you, if you're a Christian, to, uh, to live with grace and to exude grace, uh, be gracious, uh, uh, find the kind words uh, to say to people. Uh, that doesn't mean that you're going to agree with them. But at the same time, uh, uh, you, you, can, you can find good words to use to help somebody. Um, most of the people that are out prowling for uh, Christians to pray on are, are, are at war with God. They've, they've got some kind of a war going on. They're, they're, they're wanting to war with you, uh, number one, but they're also warring with God. We know that biblically. And so <clears throat> uh, here was one that just uh, happened to me. Just recently, uh, I had made a post. It doesn't really matter what the post was. It just that he figured out that I was a Christian. And, um, and he says, what a shame that people still need this delusion in their lives. What a shame that people still need this delusion in their lives. And so um, my response to him uh, was, uh, it sounds like you might be an anti-Christian. Now, I didn't want to presuppose that he was. Uh, that wouldn't be kind. Um, so I said, it sounds like you might be an anti-Christian. For 50 years, I was too, until I finally laid down my weapons. I hope you find peace one day soon. Now, you might say, well, it, maybe for you it wasn't 50 years of being an anti-Christian yourself like it was for me, but it could be that you could just say that, uh, you know, you, you could sympathize um, until you laid down your weapons. You see, there's a war that's going on. Uh, he's, he's warring with you, or he's wanting to war with you, uh, but he's also warring with God. And so, uh, uh, I, I could be sympathetic until I laid down my weapons. And then, uh, I hope you find peace one day soon. So his answer back to me was uh, anti-religion, not just anti-Christianity. I studied and researched the Bible and its history for over 35 years now, hence the atheism, and I am very peaceful because of it. I thought that was a, a reasonable answer. It wasn't a, a warring answer. And so my, my response back to him was, glad you feel at peace. That's what I'm hoping that he does. I, I'm hoping he feels at peace. Um, your comment didn't seem consistent with a peaceful heart, though more like someone who is at war. And so I wanted to just uh, 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 give him the recognition that, um, you know, it, it's, it's hard to explain how somebody can be at peace and yet at war. Uh, they're two different things. Um, and I don't think that anybody who is at war is feeling a whole lot of peace. And so that's your, your quick moment, Christian Answers to Facebook Meetings. Uh, it sounds like you might be an anti-Christian. God bless you.